Alright, so I'm going for my top 10 stocks of interest. Starting with Amazon. I know that one's popular. Whoops, why did I go with? And we're going to try to see if there's beyond a doubt any way that this thing is going to go cheaper and where it may head. For now, at the moment, it's been receiving a lot, a huge amount of buy pressure. So it's just been going up and up every time we believe that it's going to drop. Nope, it flips like it did there and just kept climbing. But as we see now, right now, it looks like it's hit a ceiling. So it's tapped a few times. Well, like four times, five times. And it just broke down. And it looks like it may continue. You're not 100% sure long term. But I would definitely like for it to lose about half its value. But for now, the target would be at about 2200 So we'll look at that for now and kind of see a longer term perspective later on. So... We'll get a look at Tesla. Whoops. It's looking about the same as Amazon. Like it wants to turn around. Like it hit a ceiling. And I will still would love for it to go to 200. I mean, right now, like, I'd still just aim for about a thousand. But. We'll see when we get to that point. But it looks it looks wonderful right now. And yeah, business has been great. It's just been getting a lot of buy pressure. Facebook. We number four. Oh, no. Wait, wait. Number three, my bad, I'm getting ahead of myself, but it's at 256. Which I can see because in this get Facebook's gonna make money no matter what, but people are definitely getting annoyed with it at this point. But for now, I wanted to see I want to see it break its trend. If it breaks its trend, it's gonna make me happy. Because right now it's just been over here just going in a straight trend and just climbing high just absorbing all the pressure because it has a lot more users because people are <clears throat> less people are working more people are at home so they have more time to just be on social media socialize with their friends video chat whatever enjoy the memes but let's wait for i want to see it break 240 my first Target would be about 180. If there was anything lower, for now, 125 would be the first target. If it were to get cheaper. And. Yeah, this is number three, number four. Apple. Apple's always going to do big things. It's just going to keep climbing. It's talking about splitting again. So if you own some shares, yeah, that's going to be great for you. But right now it's at a high 437. I could easily seeing it go down to this area i would love to see it come to about this area about the 210 area if it broke its trend overall that would be even better especially at that 200 and then 
after that it could only climb, but um the next one is gonna be number five. Ulta. You gotta think about it. Ulta major beauty retail. Uh, ladies, they go crazy for this stuff. So with that in mind, it's gonna it's gonna keep boom. It's gonna keep growing as a business. It's people love this stuff. So well, women love this stuff primarily. But I would love for it to bounce on this trend line over here at about the four one forty. It would be nice if we can get that. That's what I'm waiting on at this point. And then number six would be Microsoft. That one looks like it's turning around. It had a few taps to the high. And if it breaks its trend, it would nice to be nice to see about eighty bucks. So between a hundred to eighty is my thoughts. I want to see where it leads there. If it comes there, breaks trend, and drops, that would be lovely. But at the same time, they could see some some more pressure because they're talking about. Um, purchasing TikTok, and then you have the new Xbox release in December. So that's big money for this company, and a lot more growth. It'd be so cool if it just if you own this and it just doubled. And then number seven, we get Netflix. This company is always growing. I I keep hoping for a break of this to go down to like 150 that, that's always been my thought but it looks like it's breaking a minor trend at least it's like it's like this is going on for a lot of the big ones that are just breaking minors and but they haven't um, broken like a major trend at the moment but for now I want to see what what it looks like when it hits 360 but you know it's at 466 you kind of know what you're getting investing in and then we go for number eight. Oh crap let me pause this video all right we're gonna look into disney Okay, so right here it's looking like it may turn around for Disney as well. It would be cool to see it hit about 90 bucks at this point. Waste management is about 111, which looks like it could turn around as well. So if it's breaking its trend, obviously. It could drop, I would say, first for now, just, I'd wait for an 80 bucks. If, for me, that's a nice target. I would love to see it go, actually, not 80 bucks, 88, my bad. But, it's something that's all, waste management is always growing. It's not going to go away. It's only going to keep growing. So, only expect good things out of that. And then we can go with Zillow. So this real estate group, it's going to keep growing as well. Business may slow down for a bit. Less people will be looking for houses. So it would make sense. But at the same time, they have different ways of making money through their app. 
it's simple for them, so it can only keep growing. But if it did drop, it would be nice to see it hit about like the thirty dollar mark. I wouldn't expect it to go much lower than the twenty bucks. But overall that's what I like out of it. But um if you thought this video was pretty helpful, feel free to give it a like and feel free to subscribe as well. And if you need an app, a way to get it get started with stocks, I will put some links in the description for Robinhood and Webull. You can sign up for both and get some free stocks to get you started.